amazing subscribers, I'm Seraphim1909 and today I'd like to show you this epic slime block. This is a, not a regular slime block. It's very similar to my last video, I know that, but this is very compact, guys. You're not going to believe this. Check out what I've done. Check this out. Wait, wait, wait. So I put it in survival and bang. Like, like in the last video, I will be pushed up 30 blocks without pressing any buttons or anything at all. But the thing about this one is, it uses absolutely no redstone, no pistons, nothing. There is nothing underneath this, guys. Let's have a look real quick. If you don't believe me, let's have a quick look. Okay, so when I break this out under here, so we'll just remove all these blocks. The only thing under here was a cactus. That's it, guys. A cactus. And a bit of sand underneath. And that's it. Well, that's not 100% true. Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me show you what I'm talking about. This actually has to be built first. But as you can see, this is three times more compact than my last build. And it's very similar, but very compact. Very easy to build, and you only have to build it once. Okay, so once you press the button, it will start to duplicate any block of your choosing. I am using slime blocks. And as you can see here, it's making a bit of a bridge. Why is that, you ask? Well, simple. Because underneath the bridge, as you can see, I have a whole bunch of... Not coconuts. Huh? Why? I almost said coconuts. I have a whole bunch of cacti. I have a lot of cactus, guys, and it doesn't matter how... Look, you can go three blocks... You can have a cactus three blocks underneath this slime block. And watch this. I will still take damage from the cactus and still be pushed up 30 blocks in the air. And this only works with slime blocks, guys. This does not work with a regular slime block. So that's why this contraption exists. But once the slime block has been created, you can actually delete all this. As it is very easy to make, you can just make it on the spot. You don't need to keep it around. So if you want to freak out your friends and tell them to stand on that slime block, they're not going to know how you did it. They're not going to know how you did it unless they've seen this video. So let's get building. This is the contraption. Let's build this real quick. So you go one, two, three, four, five, six up in a zigzag motion like so. Uh, I'm going to put the redstone block right here. And from here, I'm going to put a comparator. Switch it on. So you have the comparator switched on. Now get one redstone and drag it out. One block and get out some repeaters. Okay, just whack down a repeater on no ticks. And this one on one, uh, two ticks. Okay, so I've whacked, I've touched it once. Okay. And put a redstone dust on after that block. So I'm going to use obsidian here one block high with a button on the top. That's it guys, this is pretty much it. All we have to do now is add our piston. So get a sticky piston and whack it right here on the redstone so it faces you. And now we're going to get one more sticky piston. Before we do that, we might want to put two obsidian blocks, one block high like this on each one of those grooves. That's very important to do. Okay, so now that we've done that, um, it doesn't have to be obsidian by the way. I'm just doing that just in case the slime blocks move it around. So as you can see, I've gone down two blocks and I've whacked down a regular piston facing down right there between those two blocks. It's a regular piston. This one here, however, is a sticky piston. And see what it's done there. You just gotta do that. This is it, guys. You now have the capacity to create any type of ghost block, any type. So put one slime block here and one block of choice here. Whatever block you put there, will be the block of duplication. So let's press the button and shebang. Now we have two, if not three, if not four, 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 there we go, four, five, and so on, six. Okay, so we have a lot of dirt blocks. So I'm gonna replace that and as you can see, I have obsidian next to that slime block so it doesn't move. And when I press the button, it will create a ghost block slime block. And there you have it guys, that's the slime block you need for the epic jump device. All you need underneath is two or three blocks down, it doesn't matter, a cacti. And that's it. We're done. So you can delete the rest of the other contraption, put it back in survival, tell your friends to stand on that and they will be <laughs> thrown and killed wherever it is you desire them to go. You could actually make them shoot up into an end portal, that would be epic. Okay guys, so yeah, now you can just get rid of all this crap and just cover it up with grass. You can actually put grass all around that one slime block. If you like this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe and share this video with Perth in Germany. Thanks, peace out.